look at this. What a mess. You wouldn't take paper and try to wipe this off your hands, would you? Not when you can wipe it right like that with some water. So why do we do that with our own? These are big and they're common in Europe, Latin America and Japan, where they are considered the best way to keep yourself clean. And not only that, it's considered that if someone doesn't use one, that you're unhygienic. Yet here in America, the days are a matter of custom and habit. So why are Americans skeptic of it? Well, Americans that were turning from World War II, the GI saw them used in brothels. And so they've since been associated with illicit and scandalous activities. But did you know that actually a little tidbit on history, bidets were actually introduced by the French in the 1600s to wash their privates. The word bidet actually comes from the French word for a small horse. And bidets became a luxury associated with the aristocrats and well, of course, French royals that quickly adopted them to stay clean as a luxury. And in fact, Marie Antoinette in the 1800s even had one in her prison while she was waiting execution. The English, however, refused to adopt them. They called them the French pony. And because of the English or the British's attitude toward them, that also helped shape the way that Americans feel towards them. So what are some of the benefits that everyone else in the world in Europe and Asia loves, including Latin America? And those five benefits coming from WebMD are, number one, bidets are considered more hygienic than toilet paper. Number two, they could limit the amount of germ spread. And number three, they lower your risk of hemorrhoids because you're not scrubbing so hard. And number four, they enhance your bathroom experience. I mean, you have a little bit too much Mexican, a little oscillator is a little bit better than too many scrubs. Number five, bidets are better for the environment. Hey, toilet paper takes a ton, a ton of resources. In fact, let's talk that green in conservation. The average person uses 85 rolls of toilet paper per year, or nearly 13,000 sheets, 13,000. Hey, and this is interesting. Men use an average of eight sheets while women only use six sheets. There's a lot of questions there. But anyways, if the US switched to bidets, it would save about 15 million trees. 15 million trees. And an average $400 bidet would take less than five years to pay off. Actually, it would only take about a couple years depending on how much you use your toilets. Anyways, they feel so, so much better. Like, so much. So, apart from all the benefits, they're very green, they're conservative, and as we talk about energy efficiency and everything else in, in, in the world and current politics, maybe it's time for you to get a bidet because the toilet is the last area that Americans have not luxurified. And it's time to upgrade your jets, your dryer, and that oscillating wand that self-cleans your behind.